Hello, my lovely kobolds, and welcome to Hungry Lamo. Isn't this just an adorable little title screen? Never mind the, never mind the face peeking out from the cave. Do not look at the face peeking out from the cave. Do not look at the face peeking out at the edge of the cave. Also, that rock, that rock is moving. It's wiggling. Why are some things wiggling? I just hit the quit button. I was not that scared, I swear. This game is all about a lovely, lovely llama who just wants to eat things. That's all. Narrator. Hello, Lamu. You had a good nap, didn't you? Oh dear, looks like somebody's hungry. Let's go find some food for that big stomach of yours, Lamu. Oh, I love Lamu. Look at how happy they are. Use the wast to move. Look at those ancient stone tablets. <gasps> Lamu's favorite book. Oh, Lamu loves to eat. Reading. If only Lamu could still... It, wait, no. That implies that Lamu used to be able to read, which I don't know how I feel about that one. That's a little strange. Well, there's no bones in there, so I mean, a Lamu obviously isn't eating people. Lamu's eating lots of healthy things like fruits and vegetables. I think that's wonderful. We could all take a page out of Lamu's book. Anyway, this is a game I've been wanting to share with y'all because it's amazing and lovely and wonderful. <laughs> and I haven't played it before, so this is going to be a trip. Isn't it a beautiful day, Lamu? Let's find some cherries to put in that stomach of yours. Oh, look, Lamu's a bell, too. I love Lamu's bell. Three cherries, okay. That's a tree. That's not a cherry. Um, okay. <laughs> Yay, blue. Those are blueberries. Those aren't cherries. Those are blueberries. Or unless they're... Are there... Are unripe cherries blue? <laughs> what? I love Lamu's eating sounds. I love Lamu so much. Let's eat the blue cherries, I guess? I'm so confused. I legit don't understand. There aren't any cherries beyond this point. There aren't any cherries beyond this point. Oh, we're not allowed- we're straight up not allowed to walk that way. Oh, okay. <laughs> it was like, wait, hold on, what is going on? Yum, weren't those cherries delicious? But Lamu's still hungry. Cherries are not enough for Lamu's stomach. Oh, <gasps> What's that? Oh my gosh, it's Bug Snacks. It's Lamu, Lamu and Bug Snacks world. Well, if it isn't a cute little banana. Lamu, also that banana has legs. That's very strange. Lamu loves fruits. I'm sure this banana wouldn't mind helping Lamu. Let's go meet this banana, Lamu. <gasps> it's a banana friend. Eat the banana. I love bananas. Time to eat the banana. Hello, little banana. <sighs> Wait, why is the banana barking? Is that... Why is the banana... Mm. Oh dear, looks like I was wrong. The banana is very selfish and doesn't want to help Lamu. <laughs> wait, wait. We'll need to make the banana sleep. Sleep? Excuse me? So that Lamu can have a delicious meal? Need something hard? Like a... What? Like a rock? Uh, that's... Awfully strange. That's... This is very strange. Banana won't let Lamu pass. Okay. So... We need something hard. Oh! Like a... Like a rock! Oh my god! What are we doing? Why? Oh my god! Oh sweet Jesus! Oh no! What a hearty meal! I'm sure the banana didn't mind. Despite its sour attitude, it tasted very sweet. However, there's still some space in Lamu's big stomach. Oh, what's that, Lamu? <gasps> it's a bunch of fruit friends. We don't see a lot of them around here. Their fruits should be enough to fill up Lamu's stomach. Let's go say hi to them, Lamu. Um, we didn't even eat the... B I guess we did technically eat three fruit friends. Can I make friends with them instead? Maybe they can just bring me food willingly? I don't understand. Do we... <laughs> Looks like they want to play a game. Oh my gosh, is this what happened in Dilatov Pass? <laughs> is this the deep lore behind Dilatov Pass? <laughs> Everyone was just murdered by a llama with a rock? <laughs> just like the other fruit friends we've met in the past. What do you mean? <laughs> Come on, Lamu. Let's find our new friends so we can have some of their delicious fruits. Wow, they all have such wonderfully color-coded tents. Excuse me, why is there a bunch of bees? Wait! <gasps> no! 
Why? What are we gonna do with the beehive? Why is there a fire stick? What on earth is going on? Okay. Is one of them like in a tree or something? That's my guess. Wait, there's a rock. Throw bees? <laughs> bees? I'm, I'm sorry, Nicolas Cage. I love my eyes! My eyes! Oh. Here. Oh, it's the bees stumbling everywhere. <laughs> Looks like I've gotta be careful next time. <laughs> Hey, if my apple, you deserve it. Oh my god, I don't want to. Do I have to? <sighs> oh god, we just ate his head. What about the body? <laughs> okay, can we set their tents on fire? <laughs> Why am I thinking like Lamu? I shouldn't think of like Lamu. Makes me no better than Lamu. <gasps> oh dear gods, we have an axe too. Um. Okay. Wait, why is this? Oh! <gasps> oh god! <laughs> Find pair. Uh huh. That's hot, hot, hot! Oh, jeez, couldn't you try something less burning? Well, I hope you like burn pair because it's all yours. <laughs> okay, Loma's a bit of a, um. A bit of a unique case. Okay, well, we got an axe now. <laughs> Do we just need to take the axe? Is that what we're doing next? Wait, what is that? Oh, dear gods. <gasps> oh, they can no longer escape, I guess, right? Is that how this is going? Um, yeah, great. It's, it's great, it's great. It's great, it's fine. Everything about this is fine and normal and regular and look. <laughs> I'm sorry, Orange. We need your sustenance. <laughs> <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Weren't your fruit friends just delicious, Lamu? What a great day playing with friends, eating delicious friends, having such friends. The real friends were the fruits we made along the way. Today was a marvelous day, wasn't it, Lamu? Oh, Lamu's evolving. Do -do -do -do. Do -do 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 -do. What's that, Lamu? You're still hungry. Look, it was in red. I had to read it. What? Me? Playing as. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. We now face the consequences of our actions. What the hell? It sounded like Tasha. I told them not to make so much ruckus. What, was that a dog bark? Let's see what they're up to. Did I just hear a dog bark? I'm so confused. F for flashlight. Oh, look at our spindly little arm. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't think you can see it all that well. Left shift to run. Hold tab for map. Oh, sh- <gasps> Wow, we cursed Kate. Oh, that's where Lamu was. Oh, no. E area. Keep an eye on Mochi. Leon is hot. A poo poo head. Oh my gosh. Me 12 a.m. Challenge. Bring camping stuff in. Sec repellent. Wow, there's an entire... There's an entire setup here. This is really strange. What's that? Okay, that's just a bush. <laughs> Hello? Wait, they're both green. Or maybe this one's yellow. Um, wow, that's a very sparse tent. We didn't even, like, finish unpacking. E to interact? Where did they all go? Where's Mochi? Mochi! Mochi, where are you, girl? She couldn't have run off too far. Uh, hello? Mochi? <laughs> Mochi was even named after something tasty. I think this is a path. I can feel like this is kind of. I don't think she would run off this way. Oh, did I just break the game? Okay, good. Find Mochi. Um, okay, where did we eat Mochi? I don't think she would run off this way. Okay, so it does at least guide you a little bit. Was it south? I genuinely don't remember. Is that it? Oh no. Oh, that's a rock. <laughs> Mochi, you've turned into a rock. I can't believe this. Uh, this is a path though. Oh no. Mochi. Oh, goodness gracious. You you weren't even eaten, Mochi. 
It's like something just cruelly murdered you and then <laughs> left you. M Mochi, what the fuck? Who did this? Poor girl. Whichever of you assholes did this, this is fucked up. Tasha, Ken, Leon, where the hell are you guys? I, I legit thought I was going to turn around and see Mochi. Can I? Okay, I thought I could hear something else, but I don't think that's the case. Hello? I feel like I should conserve stamina. I think they were all a- What the hell? Excuse me? I th think they were all north, and north was... Uh, okay, that's the green- t Okay, I think it was this way, right? Yeah, I think this is the path north. <gasps> what the hell? What is that sound? Is that a rock? I think that's just a rock. Why are my friends turning into rocks? I can't believe this. I think they were all around here mostly, right? And there was one like way down south? I mean, we do have paths to follow, which is good. And like, uh, another game we played, Kalkoff Slender. Um, oh my god, my friend turned into a rock. Wait, why is there a giant br Oh no! <gasps> Holy hell, this is- oh gods. Oh my gods, they were just like- oh, that's horrifying. <coughs> Holy shit. I don't even recognize him. He's burnt to a crisp. What the hell is going on? I- excuse me? What? Excuse me? I don't like this. What? Excuse me? Hello? Where's our other friend though? I don't remember. Where were the bees? I don't remember. Was it west? I like. Oh god. Oh, I hate this. Oh, okay. I thought it was west. Or is this north? I don't know. I don't know my directions. I'm too scared to know directions. Got it? <gasps> no! No! Lamu's literally slender. Oh, there's Lamu. Hi. See you, friend. Cool. Awesome. Fantastic. Oh, he's legitimately just watching us from afar. I don't remember where they died. I don't remember. Where was it? Wasn't it over this way? Oh, wow. This is a really big uh, area. Hello? What the hell? Oh, God. There he is. Okay. There's... <laughs> okay, hi. Hi, friend. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna be sick. Why are there so many damned bees? Who did this to you, Ken? Oh my god, it was Barbie. Barbie did this to Ken. I think it was by the Pierre. Yeah, I don't like that. Do I need to, like, look? Do I actually need to be aware? I am... This game is... Terrifying enough to where I am legitimately unsure if I'm supposed to be, like, looking out? Or not? <laughs> okay... Okay, no, the Pieria was right for us where our dog was. Hi. Okay. I do not remember. I don't remember where the third one was. Why is my memory so bad for this? I don't know if it's just fear or what. Where was the last one? The last one was down here, right? Oh, great. I can tell he's running around us. Was it down here? I do not know. I do not know. I thought it was this way. Oh, great. No, there was one more path. There was one more path. Okay, I might have messed up a little bit. Okay. Oh, I thought that rock moved. Oh, wait. Wait, what? No, we just wound up... <gasps> wait, I don't... Wait. Wait. Eat interact? Is this the first cave they keep talking about? Shit. Better safe in there than out here. Oh no, we never even found our friend. What is this? Wait, I didn't see any skulls before. Why are there so many? Oh, okay. Um, <laughs> oh, oh, lovely. Miss Mum Evil. Surprise, today's Llama's birthday. His mom and dad made him a delicious fruitcake. Oh my, mom, dad, what a nice surprise, Lamu exclaimed. I didn't know you both could bake. 
Only fruit, 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 only fruit. The Llama is Hungry. A short story by Kulu. A children's book? Oh, wow, there's actually... This book belongs to... So did Lamu try to teach himself to read? It's a new day today. Everyone's waking up. Llama sees the sunshine and wakes up with a big yawn. It's a daily routine for this young animal to wake up, well rested, at the break of dawn. Rumble, rumble. Llama's stomach growls. Looks like Llama's hungry for some fresh food. Oh dear me, that's the sign to go, Llama said. Time for some breakfast. I sure hope it's good. Miss Home. Llama leaves his home, whistling as he walks, thinking of the adventure to find his meal. Tweet, tweet, toot. Toot, toot, tweet. He whistles glee gleefully. <laughs> gleefully. Overwhelming euphoria is what he truly feels. There's a page torn out. Wonderful. How... <laughs> How rude of me, Llama says. What a delicious fruit. Truly tasty. Llama pats himself, satisfied with his feast. Now he has to head home. Best not be lazy. They are fruits. 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 No more home. Llama walks back home, belly very full. He reaches his home just when the moon rose. He entered the door with a smile on his face. But what he saw next made him struck a pose. Dr. Bronze exposed. Oh no! Did he turn himself into a llama? Interspecies genetics fusion. Oh, sign me right up. I mean, <clears throat> no, 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 no. That, that, this is, that's not the point of this story. That's not the point of the story. <clears throat> Human animal genetic fusion? I, <laughs> no, that's, who would want to do that? I can't believe it. <laughs> All your fault. I did not want anymore. After a long day and a fun time, Llama head to bed. He tucked himself into his warm blanket and thought to himself, what a fun day, reminiscing about tomorrow's banquet. The end. Still hungry. I don't want to turn around. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> oh, my God. I need a moment. <laughs> I, I, I knew it was going to happen, and it was still terrifying. Murder at the Bronze Resident. All right, I don't think I'm going to read all of that, but... TLDR, if you want to pause and read it, go for it. The TLDR is, uh, genetic experiments. Wonderful. The Kulu Times, 1977. Interesting. <gasps> oh, and there he is, the Canadidus, just staring, waiting. Waiting to come have a nice, tasty treat of some, you know, innocent campers. Anyway, <laughs> thank you for all joining me on this horribly... And this horror, this, this horribly terrifying story about a simple, regular old, genetically engineered spliced doctor llama. Wonderful. <laughs> oh, please. There are two other endings, so I urge you to go check them out if you want to. Um, this game is free, and it's very short and sweet and terrifying and oh my gods. I urge you to find your own fruit friends if you so wish. Have a lovely night, everyone, and remember. Genetic interspecies splicing is only a matter of time.